From childhood, I loved to watch the artisans at work. It'd be the glass blower or the clog maker. I could stay in the shop for hours, and I knew even from that early stage that my hands were also made for this kind of work. I call myself a fibre and textile artist, but really, when it gets down to it, I'm a maker. The focus has been on wool and felt making. I love the transformational quality that it has. I am able to use my hands to seduce the wool into becoming some sort of new form. I have to respect the rules and the behaviours of the wool. And with this mutual respect, I'm able to create new and interesting forms. I'm inspired by my natural environment, the Australian bush that I live in, the natural forms and colours, and my work finds its own path to organic shapes and spaces. Each of these activities in the workshop has begun in that way through nutting out a logistical problem, working with the wool, its qualities, trying to find the solutions needed. I hope that students, through working through the class activities, will gain a little bit of a what-if attitude to their own felt making. Really play and explore with your work. Gaining those skills, gaining those techniques through the workshop is going to help them then to be able to understand the behaviours and the limitations of the wall and then through that it'll feed their creativity.